Did you ever wonder how Afghanistan, a country often in the news, has shaped the world? Afghanistan, a land of rugged beauty and ancient traditions, has played a pivotal role in global events far beyond its borders. Its rich tapestry of history, culture and geography has shaped not just the nation itself but the world at large. Intriguing, isn't it? What secrets does this country hold? What stories does it have to tell? Join us as we embark on a journey through time, exploring the rich history of this remarkable nation. Our journey begins in ancient times, where Afghanistan was a crossroads of the world. Nestled in the heart of Asia, it bridged the east and west, serving as a vital link in the Silk Road, that fabled network of trade routes that connected China to the Mediterranean. Afghanistan's early history is a tapestry of civilizations. The first to leave their mark were the Indo-Iranians, who arrived around 2000 BC, establishing the Bronze Age cultures of Bactria and Margiana. These societies were known for their sophisticated urban planning and their intricate gold-laden artwork. Then came the Achaemenid Empire, the first of the Persian dynasties in the 6th century BC. Under Cyrus the Great and his successors, Afghanistan was integrated into an empire that stretched from Egypt to India. This was followed by the conquest of Alexander the Great, who left behind a legacy of Hellenistic culture that melded with the local traditions. Afghanistan's strategic position along the Silk Road drew the attention of the mighty Kushan Empire, which flourished from the 1st to the 3rd centuries AD. At its height, the Kushan Empire extended from Central Asia to Northern India, and its capital, Bagram, was a bustling hub of trade and culture. The Kushans were succeeded by a string of empires from the Sassanids and Hephthalites to the Islamic Caliphates. Each left their own indelible imprint, contributing to the rich cultural mosaic that is Afghanistan. The Mongol invasion in the 13th century, led by Genghis Khan, brought devastation but also the exchange of ideas and technologies. The Timurid Empire in the 15th century fostered a cultural renaissance, with Herat becoming a center of art and learning. Through the rise and fall of empires, Afghanistan retained its vital role as a conduit for trade, ideas and cultural exchange. Its rich history is a testament to the resilience and adaptability of its people, who have navigated the complex dynamics of power and culture for millennia. Thus, Afghanistan's strategic location has always made it a coveted region for empires and traders alike. Fast forward to the Islamic Golden Age, when Afghanistan was at the heart of a cultural and intellectual revolution. In this golden era, spanning from the 8th to the 14th century, the world bore witness to an explosion of knowledge and ideas, with Afghanistan serving as a pulsating hub of this vibrant intellectual activity. Afghan scholars, thinkers and inventors were at the forefront, contributing immensely to the fields of astronomy, mathematics and medicine. Consider, for instance, the realm of astronomy. The stars were not just points of light in the sky for these scholars, they mapped the heavens, calculated the orbits of celestial bodies and even developed the concept of the celestial sphere. Their meticulous observations and calculations laid the groundwork for future astronomical advancements. Then there's the field of mathematics. The Islamic Golden Age was a period of mathematical flourishing. Afghan scholars played a significant role in developing algebra, geometry, and trigonometry. The brilliant mathematician Al-Khwarizmi, often hailed as the father of algebra, was one such luminary. His works had a profound influence not only in the Middle East but also in Europe, shaping the course of mathematical thought for centuries to come. Let's not forget medicine. The medical advancements during this era were nothing short of extraordinary. Afghan physicians and scholars made significant strides in understanding the human body, diagnosing diseases and creating innovative treatments. They established hospitals, wrote encyclopedic works on medicine and even pioneered surgical techniques that are still in use today. From the twinkling stars above to the complex world within us, Afghan scholars during the Islamic Golden Age were relentless in their pursuit of knowledge. They questioned, they explored and they invented. This era of intellectual curiosity and scientific exploration forever changed the course of human history. This era, brimming with intellectual prowess, left an indelible mark on human civilization. As we move into the modern era, Afghanistan continues to shape world events. The latter part of the 20th century and the early years of the 21st have seen this nation at the epicenter of global attention, impacting not only its own people, but also reverberating across continents. 
The Soviet invasion in the late 70s marked a significant turning point. This period of 10 years was characterized by intense conflict and upheaval as the people of Afghanistan resisted foreign control. The repercussions of this struggle were felt far beyond the country's borders, contributing to the end of the Cold War and reshaping the geopolitical landscape. Following the Soviet withdrawal, the nation plunged into a brutal civil war. Various factions vied for control, leading to a period of instability and strife. This era had profound implications for the international community, as the absence of a stable government allowed extremist groups to gain a foothold, with consequences still felt today. The dawn of the new millennium saw the world's superpower, the United States, intervene in Afghanistan in what became known as the War on Terror. This conflict lasting for two decades was a response to attacks orchestrated by extremists based within Afghanistan's borders. The war had far-reaching effects influencing global politics, international relations and prompting a re-evaluation of foreign intervention strategies. Yet amidst these tumultuous times, Afghanistan has showcased an indomitable spirit. The resilience of its people is evident in their determination to rebuild, to educate and to strive for a better future. Despite the hardships, they have persevered, continuing to contribute to the rich tapestry of their nation's history. From the bustling streets of Kabul to the rugged mountains of the Hindu Kush, Afghanistan's story is a tale of survival, of resilience and of an undying hope for a brighter future. The country's modern history is a testament to its capacity to endure and adapt, to rise from the ashes and to keep moving forward. Despite the trials and tribulations, Afghanistan's resilience is a testament to its enduring spirit. Beyond the headlines, Afghanistan is a land of incredible cultural richness. As we delve deeper into the heart of this resilient nation, we find a treasure trove of unique traditions and customs that truly define the Afghan experience. Let's start with Afghan music, a vibrant tapestry of sounds that echoes the nation's diverse ethnic groups. From the rhythmic beats of the dambura, a long-necked lute, to the soulful melodies of the rubab, Afghanistan's national instrument, music is a cornerstone of Afghan identity. It's not uncommon to hear these harmonious tunes at gatherings, celebrations, and even in the quiet of the evening, resonating in harmony with the setting sun. And then there's Afghan poetry, a beautiful art form steeped in centuries of history. Poetry is woven into the fabric of everyday life, a testament to the Afghan people's love for the written and spoken word. From the epic verses of the Shanama to the passionate ghazals of Rumi, the poetic tradition continues to thrive, offering a profound insight into the Afghan psyche. No discussion of Afghan culture would be complete without mentioning its delectable cuisine. Afghan meals are a delightful fusion of flavors, combining the hearty goodness of locally grown produce, fragrant spices and succulent meats. From the comforting warmth of Kabuli Pulao, a rice dish adorned with raisins and carrots, to the sweet delicacy of sheer yak and Afghan ice cream, the culinary landscape is as diverse as the country itself. But perhaps the most famous aspect of Afghan culture is its legendary hospitality. Visitors are treated with utmost respect and kindness, a reflection of the Afghan belief in Pashtunwali, an ancient code of conduct emphasizing honor, courage and generosity. This hospitality is not just a mere formality, but a deeply ingrained part of Afghan ethos, a symbol of their unwavering spirit. These elements of culture often overlooked are the true heart of this resilient nation. So what have we learned about Afghanistan? Our journey began in ancient times, where Afghanistan stood as a crossroads of culture and commerce, its rugged landscapes and strategic location making it a crucial part of the Silk Road. Its historical importance is undeniable with its soil bearing witness to the march of empires from the Persians to the Greeks and many more. We then stepped into the Islamic Golden Age, where Afghanistan served as a beacon of knowledge and progress, contributing to the development of mathematics, science and art. Its scholars and thinkers, their names echoing down the centuries, played an instrumental role in shaping the world as we know it. In the modern era, Afghanistan's tale is one of resilience and survival. Despite the challenges it faces, the country has remained steadfast, navigating the complex currents of geopolitics and emerging with its spirit unbroken. 
Lastly, we explored the vibrant tapestry of Afghanistan's culture and traditions, from the hauntingly beautiful music of the rubab to the intricate designs of Afghan rugs, the artistic soul of the nation shines brightly, a testament to its rich heritage. As we've seen, Afghanistan's story is one of resilience, innovation and survival, reflecting the spirit of its people. This is a land that carries the weight of history, yet looks forward with hope and determination. Thank you for joining us on this journey through time.